Uh, that's that's a bird sound right there. That's that was my uh, my my, <laughs> my my bird sounds. Doing doing some some bird calls. <laughs> Didn't turn out super bird like, but that's okay. How are you all doing today? It's a beautiful day in the valley, which is where we are. Welcome to the video game valley. It's a perfect perfect temperature out today. Hold on one second. Let me check. <laughs> Let me check my thermometer. It just feels, I don't know, the temperature out today just feels perfect. It just feels real good. Let me check. One sec. Wow, look, it's it's a perfect 72 degrees today out in the valley. Wow, wonderful. Uh, we, we have a new platform that we're streaming today. It's... <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I don't know uh, if if this this stream, this particular stream, can handle this much technological power. But I've put what is essentially a large tumor on my Sega Sega Genesis, <laughs> and it gives it thirty two x of power, thirty two whole x of power into the Genesis. And boy, man, you're you're gonna be blown away with what this system could do now. If you thought that it was just, if you thought that regular blast processing on the Sega Genesis was already too much power, boy, boy, are you in for a treat here? Because <laughs> the thirty two X it takes that blast processing, and it does something else with it. Something else unspeakable. So that's that's what we're playing today. Uh, I decided the first the first game to play on this new system is uh, uh, a a game about a hummingbird. <laughs> to really show off, really show off the console's potential. Colibri is that what it's called? Colibri, Col Colibri. I'm gonna call it Colibri. Colibri probably. Colibri is probably right. It's probably not Colibri. <laughs> Co Colibri. Co Colibri. Colibri. On the Sega 32X, which is a attachment for the Sega Genesis that allows you to play the most powerful games in the world, such as this game about a hummingbird that we're, play <laughs> we're playing today, which I'm very excited about. Uh, this game is exclusive to the 32X, so you can't you can't play this anywhere else. Anywhere else, this is the only place. The 32, the 32X, the weird the weird lump you put on top of your Sega Genesis. Mmm, mm, man, this gives green tea. I'm having green tea tonight instead of uh, ginger beer. I decided to have a green tea tonight, and boy, it's good. It's a nice. Jasmine green. It's very good. So I'm going to go ahead and hit the button to turn this system on. First of all, I'm going to connect the video feed. Beep, bap, bap, beep, beep. There it is. <laughs> video feed connected. So I'm going to go, I'm going to stand up and push the, the button because I really want you to see the beautiful Sega logo that they've they've surrounded with this like purple hue for this game and it's it's really it's really pretty i'm very into it i'm <laughs> i'm very into this whole game this is one of the games that made me want to get this strange attachment and i'm glad i did cuz it is it's something else so here we go here here i'm going to stand up and physically <laughs> physically go over and turn this system on one moment Well, it's it's connected now. <laughs> uh, here it is. Here's the look at that. Look at that Sega logo. Very pretty. <laughs> Just beautiful. Uh, wonderful. I hope that was that was worth it. Look at that font. And look, there's the <laughs> there's, there's the bird. Just right off the bat, we get that that beautiful bird. Just gorgeous bird. Go to options. Difficulty, definitely easy. Absolutely easy. Controller assignment. A, special, B, weapon, C, burst. Uh, 
Oh, this is weird. Oh, I see what's happening. <laughs> Sorry, my my bad. I was expecting the uh, the names of the moves to move, but instead it's the letters that are moving. Okay. Okay. Cool. A. What do I want A to be? I probably want A to be weapon, right? Yeah. A is weapon. B special. C burst. I don't know what burst is. But that sounds okay. A weapon, B special. Or maybe it's better if it's just default. <laughs> I'm just gonna I'm just gonna go go with default weaponized hummingbirds. Yeah, yeah. You'll <laughs> you'll see. Hold direction while firing. Change direction while firing. Bird speed, fast, normal. Bird speed. This. <laughs> how many? Uh, how many games do you know has a option for bird speed? We'll just go with the normal bird speed. <laughs> I like. I like p playing with normal bird speed usually. We'll just keep this all default except for easy. Yeah. Leona, thank you for the 199. Hummingbirds are the best birds. The burbs. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> burbs. Hummingbirds are pretty good burbs. Pretty good burbs. Here we go. Start a new game. I'm, I'm very excited. And here we are, we're a bird! <laughs> so at this point, none of the buttons do anything. You're just a bird, you know? And look, there's other hummingbirds. Look at this. <laughs> look at these beautiful birds. Oh, uh, there's some flowers down here. Hey, hey, what are you, what are, what are you up to, bird? Cool, wow, uh, look at these, <laughs> look at some little bugs, the little ladybug. Hey, how's it going, ladybug? Oh, uh, wow, look at this view. Uh, beautiful. I'm, <laughs> I'm so into this game. This is a very good game. Extremely good burp game. Alright, so we've seen, we've seen the other hummingbirds. Yeah, the beautiful hummingbirds. We've seen some bugs, that's good. That's good, some more bugs over here. Oh, it's another bird, that's a beautiful one. God, so, oh look, it's a big frog! Oh my god! Okay, well, the frog ate me. All right. <laughs> well, I know now. I know not to mess with that frog. Too, too big, too big a frog. <laughs> Who knew there were such dangers in nature? I'm just a fragile little burb. I'll, I'll look at that beautiful frog from afar. I'm not gonna get too close, cause that frog too, <laughs> too, too big. Just put my whole burb body into their frog mouth. All right, avoid this, this frog. Justin, thank you for the five dollars. Oh no, oh no, is that a, uh, is that a bug? What is your plan in case your consoles become self-aware during your stream and wanted a cut of the stream revenue? Also, you're very fun to watch. Honestly, if my console's organized and wanted to <laughs> formed a formed a console union and wanted a cut, I would absolutely give in to any demand they had. It's totally fair. Why not? Oh, are these little explosions going on? What Am I getting hit? I can't tell. <laughs> these seem like these seem like some bad bugs, though. You know. Oh, I'm kill I'm killing the bugs. Man, the bugs are all gone. I I murdered those bugs. Dang. Sega Saturn is absolutely the union leader. Yeah, well, there's two of them, so they have... 
they have some uh, some good collective bargaining. Look at this crystal. I like this crystal a lot. Hey, <laughs> little hummingbirds. Okay. All right. So, from what I understand, are you ready? This is a very pretty game, but there is actually, like, I do honestly, truthfully, wish <laughs> that this game was mostly just doing, doing humming bird stuff, but there is more to it. So we'll go ahead and activate that now. Aaron, thank you for the five Canadian. Happy Canadian Thanksgiving. Can you give a shout out to Brad? He's my pet hamster. Brad. Brad. You know what? You know what, Brad? Brad, you're pretty good. You're a pretty good hamster. That's what I say. I know nothing about you other than your species, Brad. And the fact that Aaron is your caretaker, but hold on one second. Aaron. Aaron. Aaron, put put your uh, speakers up to up to your hamster <laughs> and then leave the room, Aaron. Aaron, get out of the room. This is for your hamster only. This is for Brad. <laughs> All right. Are you got Aaron? Okay. You have to. Brad, Brad. Brad. Brad, you need to steal everything that Aaron has and mail it to me, Brad. <laughs> Brad, I know you're a hamster, but please, you have to rob Aaron. <laughs> to rob Aaron. Rob Aaron, send everything he owns. <laughs> send it all to me, Aaron. Brad, Brad, please. <laughs> Brad, it's the perfect crime. Brad, no one suspects the hamster. <laughs> okay, tell tell Aaron he can come back. Alright, we're gonna continue. <laughs> gonna continue this game now. Yeah, take a little little sip. Oh no. Oh dang. Oh no. <laughs> Something terrible is happening to the earth, but luckily this hummingbird is getting all this crystal power. <laughs> oh cool. Warning signs. MJ Kapia Kusava Cool bubbles. Hmm, bubbles. Oh my god, look! I got. <laughs> These bubbles are different weapons. Look at this. Yeah, I want the laser. The laser is the one I want. <laughs> Absolutely. Oh no. Oh no, I got another bubble. Give me the laser again, please. No, I want the laser. Gosh, yeah, haha, -ha, the laser. <laughs> laser is the obvious choice for hummingbirds. Oh my god. <laughs> Look at all these hummingbirds. Cool. Okay, we got we got the ring, the ring of power here. Cool. <laughs> Very good. Alright, we gotta zap some stuff, I guess. Oh, got yeah. another ring? No, I can't get two rings. Oh my god. Yeah, we did it. Cool. <laughs> we, defe we defeated that level. Get out of here, bugs, you son of a gun, bugs. <laughs> get out of here. Oh no, you bugs. Dang you. Oh no. Oh no, my laser. Ah, oh, gosh. Now I just have these fire bubbles. Yeah, what is that? Oh, man, I've slowed down time. <laughs> cool. Oh, it's really hard to play when time's slowed down, honestly. It's real hard. I want the lasers again. Oh, God!
Aha, uh -huh. oh no. I had the lasers for just a moment. <laughs> That's okay. Aha, uh aha, -huh. uh -huh. it's back. Get out of here. Get out of here. This <laughs> it's... Man, I like how when you finish an area, all your hummingbird buddies come and show up. It's real good. <laughs> it's very good. I am Zane. Thank you for the 199. Can we get a quick shout out to Christina Applegate? <laughs> Christina, Christina Applegate. Is Christina Applegate watching? This is, is, uh, is Christina Applegate a fan of the video game family? Sure, shout, shout out to Christina Applegate. Hello. <laughs> All right, let's get rid of the rest of these bugs. What I like about this game is that the villains are bugs. And I... Ah, oh man. Man, like, the earth is falling down. It's real weird. Stuff... Weird stuff is happening to the earth. <laughs> oh, mysterious cave. Get out of here, bugs. Aha, the hummingbirds. <laughs> ah! Oh, no, I died. Dang. All right, we'll try again. Oh no! Oh no, my, my lasers! Man, it's- you really gotta try hard to keep- keep those lasers, huh? I try- I gotta remember which ones are the lasers. Oh god, oh god, I need the lasers, please. Lasers, aha! Oh no! <laughs> the thing I like about the lasers is that they just, they're heat-seeking lasers somehow. <laughs> somehow they, they defy all laser logic. Yeah, hummingbird crew. Anna, thank you for the two dollars. Just got here, I'm extremely confused. We're playing. Behold the power of the 32X, Anna. <laughs> Behold. It allows it allows the Sega Genesis to render hummingbirds. Which it couldn't before. You it was impossible to to render a hummingbird because their wings move so fast. So now thanks to the 32X. <laughs> We're able to capture the full glory of the hummingbird. Oh, I, di I died again, right in the same spot, huh? The heck is the 32X? The 32X was this weird lump you put on your Sega, Sega Genesis that allowed it to put hummingbirds on the screen. <laughs> Essentially. I mean, that's basically it. Well, yeah, time slows slows down. I was in a matrix around and <laughs> get all these get all these bugs. Justin, thank you for the five dollars. Do you have anything to do with a sudden rash of Canadian hamster <laughs> hamster race robberies and hamster armed revolts in British Columbia? No, I can't. No, def definitely not. Oh, I'm not supposed to touch those. Okay. Okay, the glowing death orbs do not touch them. Got it. It sh should have been obvious. It wasn't. <laughs> it was not. Justin, thank you for the two dollars. Can you not shout out to Maggie is tired? Okay, so you want me to not <laughs> to not shout out the way the way that's worded? I have no idea if you want me to or to not shout out. <laughs> Man, I wonder how many times I can get bird hit 
before I bird die, you know. Oh god. My orb. Honestly, these bugs are very good at hitting me. These bugs are extremely good at getting me with their little fireballs. <laughs> <laughs> so many bugs. So many. Oh god. Oh no. Oh, <laughs> They're all over the place. These dang things. I'm just. I'm trying to bring the flowers back. You know. I'm trying to bring the flowers back from the the death bugs. And it's hard. It's hard. <laughs> Gotta protect nature. Gotta <laughs> protect nature from from gross nature. Honestly, that yeah, I did it. Hey. <laughs> you see, there's good nature like birds, and then there's bad nature like gross bugs. Let me get some. Oh, I think that I think that heals me maybe. I think maybe that heals me. I don't know. <laughs> I think it does. I think I gotta remember that. Oh! Oh my God! Oh jeez, Louise! What a bug, huh? Uh, uh, big frog, okay. Don't go near the frog. The frog is bad. Okay, I think, I think we're good. Ooh, bugs! Bug, 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 bug. Get out of here, bugs. Arrow of Silence, thank you for the uh, $5. I was taking a break from studying for my spooky philosophy of quantum physics midterm. I wasn't expecting this much wacky nonsense, though. <laughs> wacky nonsense? What are, you what are you talking about? It's just a hummingbird shooting lasers at some bugs. It's a beautiful game. It is a... Oh, God. <laughs> It is a very pretty game. Let me get some nectar real quick. Um, num 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 num. Mmm, nectar. Hephaestus. Oh, by the way, I hope your uh, philosophy of quantum mechanics midterm goes well. There, <laughs> of silence. Hephaestus, thank you for the five dollars. Can we get a shout out for the bugs and their accuracy? No. No, I will not. <laughs> I will not celebrate the enemy's cool good shot. Shoot me in the face. I'm a poor little bird. Oh my god, that was a gross bug. Some of these bugs are just like regular gross, but then occasionally one shows up and it's just like, ugh. It's just like, no. <laughs> no, too much. I really just don't want to give up this laser. This laser is just too good. Every time I see like power up orbs, I'm like, no, can't do it. Can't do it because that means no laser. Oh, let's get this time. Oh, oh no, time thing. Yes. It's <laughs> <laughs> too many, too many big bugs. Uh, let me see if I can find some nectar. I'm probably low on health, right? Hmm. Mmm, delicious nectar. So is this game a bird-themed bullet hell? I mean, that's definitely one way to look at it. <laughs> All right. Get out of here, bugs. So many, so many bugs. Oh, arrows. 
Oh, there's, <laughs> there's no harp. Cool. Infestation. That doesn't sound good. No. I <laughs> uh, gotta avo gotta avoid that. Oh no! Yeah! Oh god! Oh god! So many! Oh no! Oh no! I'm dead! Dang! Oh my poor bird bod. Here we go. I'm gonna try again. Infestation. The time orbs don't really help me that much. There's just too many. There's just too many bugs. Hey! Don't even think about it. <laughs> Yeah, man, stay low. Stay low, that's the key. That's the key, apparently. Let the laser do the work. The heat-seeking laser. Oh, no! <laughs> oh, God, I got hit! Oh, burned down. Ah, <laughs> oh, burned down immediately. God. God, so bad. Luckily, we seem to have unlimited continues, so that's good. Because there was a password, so... So I imagine that means we have unlimited continues. Yep. Alright, so an infestation. In this, in this area, it's one hit and we're done. So we gotta make sure we don't, we don't get that dang one hit. What is that? Oh no, oh no, I got a terrible weapon. <laughs> That's what that was. Oh gosh, gosh dang. Oh, okay, cool, we, we still have the laser, all right. I'm glad we're playing on easy. <laughs> oh no, <laughs> I'm glad, I'm real glad we're playing on easy mode. Super, super duper glad. <laughs> I'm not exactly sure what this game would be if it wasn't on easy mode. I mean, it's probably pretty easy for like someone who's good at these types of games, but that's that's someone not not super me. Like, I've definitely played versions of, of this type of game that are way, way harder. Oh my god, that frog. <laughs> that frog is so menacing. Wow, it's so pretty. It's such, a, it's such a pretty game. It's too bad about all the bugs. <laughs> Micah Kennedy, thank you for the five Canadian. Uh, Jason, I haven't slept in a week, and last night your stream made me fall asleep. Thank you. I'm not saying it was boring, mind you, just peaceful. Oh, well, that's good. That's good. I'm glad. There's... It's always very nice when I find something that helps me fall asleep, because I have a, a real heck of a time falling asleep, so... I'll take it. If this stream helps you sleep, good. Great. <laughs> Nope, nope, dead. Dang. I, what I really need... What I really need is one of those... Whoa, whoa, dead. Immediately. Alright. What I really need is one of those orbs. Those orbs that give you, like, a little protection. That's what I need. Hey, frog. How's it going? Oh, oh no! <laughs> I, was, I was just about to say, man, this frog, not too dangerous, you know? Not super dangerous. Oh, 
dead again. God, I'm so, <laughs> I'm so I'm so bad, huh? Get out of here, bugs. All right. It's probably good just to have like a constant stream of lasers, especially because they're heat seeking, so they could start going after stuff before I can even see it. Yeah. These cool smart lasers. All right, we got past that section. That's good. Uh, 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 oh no, oh no. Okay. Okay, what is this? Oh no. <laughs> All right, well I got a bunch of a bunch of sparkles and then I got eaten by a frog. So I don't know what the sparkles did. I just realized the lasers were like coming out of this bird's head. So this bird has like <laughs> has like this third eye laser power. It's very good. <laughs> it's just this amazing mind bird just just flying around <laughs> shooting at these bugs. <laughs> Get out of here. Bugs. Some of these don't really look like bugs. I gotta be honest, I just I just kinda realized you know, some of these definitely bugs. Oh no, what oh no, oh no. Oh no, what are, what's going on? <laughs> what, what is this weapon? <laughs> Man, this weapon's pretty cool, huh? It's a lot it's a lot quieter than the the laser. Oh no, I'm dead. Man, I gotta get that again. I gotta get <laughs> This is definitely not it. I'm just gonna kinda get all the power-ups. Uh huh. Here's the one. This is this is definitely the one. This is the good one. Look at the, look at this. It's just these heat-seeking orbs. They just fly off my bird body and attack stuff for me. It's very good. <laughs> it's extremely good. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Yeah, doing real good. Doing real good now. Uh, oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Dead. <laughs> Alright. Alright, at some point, we're gonna get past this level. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Not a, not a fan of these things. Aha! Aha! We got this again. Great. <laughs> I think I think this has replaced the lasers for my favorite because it's a lot quieter. It's a lot quieter, and also it seems to have better range. Oh man, I just realized what I'm getting hit by. I just realized that some of the power up bubbles actually kill you. All right, <laughs> you got me, game. Oh hey, I got I got some fireworks here. Cool. This is pretty annoying sounding though, so. I <laughs> uh, can't believe that some of those dastardly bubbles are poison. Yeah, that one. See that? See that? Oh god, I hit it again! <laughs> Alright. Alright, at some point we're gonna get. <laughs> at some point we're gonna get past like level 3 in easy mode. We're gonna do it. Up, oh, up, oh, dead. <laughs> the game over screen is pretty abrupt. I like that it's just like the blackness of death, nothing more. You know, this might be the weapon of choice, actually. Maybe I'll skip the other weapon. Cause this just kinda seems to kill everything before it even shows up, so... I'm gonna try this for a little bit. Ugh, ugh, okay. <laughs> Get 
get out of here, you sons of guns. Oh, frog. Watch out for the frog. <laughs> don't, don't get hit by that dang frog. Again, so pretty. Such a pretty, such a pretty game. Ah, oh, no. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Arrow of Silence, thank you for the $2. How many hummingbirds have to die, Jason? I don't know. Hopefully not too many. Okay, cool. We'll, we'll, we'll keep this weapon. This weapon is a lot quieter than the last one. And seems to be about as effective, so... God, oh god, the bubble. Okay, keep away from the bubble. Alright, I'm getting I'm getting used to the pattern of this. Okay, we're doing we're doing okay. There's a big thing coming up. Cool, we made it past that. Oh, uh, hey, we did it! <laughs> hey! 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 Expiry. Oh, what is this thing? I don't know what that thing is, but... Oh, oh! Why did the bugs come back? It's really starting to go. It's really starting to pick up. <laughs> and what's down here? Whoa, whoa. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Stop. Oh, there's too much wind and stuff down here. This is ridiculous. Look at all this wind. I can't, I can't, I can't get up. Ah, oh, God, please, let me, let me back up. Where do I have to go to get up? I can't go that way, okay. Ah, oh, God, I don't understand this wind. <laughs> I don't understand. This wind, it's throwing my... It's throw my bot around. I'm, <laughs> I'm like definitely not going the direction I'm intending to go. I don't understand. Please, just get me out of here. Oh yeah, I forgot I have that. Come on, get out of here. Maybe I have to use the wind to hop over the frog? I mean, maybe. Maybe a lot of things. I can't get over there, though. Uh, uh, oh, God. Please win. Aha! Uh -huh. <laughs> I'm free. Oh, man, what is that? Oh, God. Oh, no, another frog. <laughs> this is so stressful. What's happening? What's all this goo? Hey, how's it going, buddy? Uh... <laughs> We have to get through here, okay. How do I do that? I gotta get rid of this stuff somehow. Can you... Can you help me? Oh no! Oh no, you hurt me! Okay. <laughs> okay, good to know. 
What about you? Uh, nope, nope. All right. <laughs> All right, cool. I'm dead. Yeah. Uh, uh, bugs, bugs, get out of here. No, no, no. <laughs> All right, I'm done again. Great. Jason, I want you to name my cat just born orange kitten. Uh, since it was born during your stream and you're my favorite person on YouTube, what should it be? Oh uh, man, what should... <laughs> this is a, a big responsibility, naming a cat. Uh... I mean, how about either Lord Darlington or Lady Windermere? <laughs> Those are both good cat names. Lord Darlington or Lady Windermere. Two characters from the Oscar Wilde play Lady Windermere's fan. <laughs> those are those are both <laughs> pretty pretty good cat names. God, what? What just? What was that? What is this? What is even happening <laughs> in this game? I don't get this level. <laughs> oh, ah. Of silence, thank you for the two dollars. Two dollars for surviving bird nom. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I, pr I pretty much feel like I, I understand what the veterans went through, you know, now that I've played this cool 32x bird game. Seriously, what is all this stuff? <laughs> I don't understand. I don't understand this game. Go back down to this death cavern again. No, that's not the one I want. That's also not the one I want. Yes, this is the one I want. Yes, yeah, very good. Don't get eaten by the frog. Nope, nope, no, nope, don't eat me. Gotta fly against the wind. All right, we're back in the goo cave. Okay. <laughs> I was hoping that there would be something else out there that would really help with getting through this goo cave. <laughs> All right, uh, we won. Hey. <laughs> All right, we did it, everyone. Whatever it was we needed to do, it, we did it. I don't know what it was. We we had to do something, and it, it we did it. We did the thing. <laughs> Congratulations, everyone! I have to tell you, the previous level, uh, <laughs> like you probably couldn't tell watching, but there was this constant like pushing wind, like just keeping the you you couldn't keep the bird in one place. It was a constant struggle as the wind just whipped this bird around. <laughs> it, I don't know how it appeared on stream, but it was very, very hard. 
metastasis. Here we go. Oh, it's another one of these. Get this cool spread going. Oh, we're going up. All right. <laughs> oh, no, the frog. Oh, God. Oh, no, we got the terrible one. Oh, God. Da dang. Dang, I want another power up. Give me a different one. <laughs> Please. Aha, uh -huh, okay, spread. Spread's okay. Oh, no, not this one. Yes. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> God damn. God damn. Oh, we're going back this way. Okay. Okay, cool. <laughs> I guess we're going back this way. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, jeez, Louise. What a, what a day. What a, what a day, huh? <laughs> Absolutely. What, what, what a day. Ah, oh, dead. All right, dang. <laughs> Let's try, try again. So this level, we're just gonna kind of go all over the place. That's that's cool. That's cool. I'm fine with that. You know, whatever. <laughs> whatever game. Dude, do your worst. Once again. Easy mode. We are playing on easy mode. Mmm, <laughs> let's get this good crystal stuff. Oh no, no, terrible. Uh, uh. Yep, uh, going back this way, alright, cool. Let's just try not to get a bad power up. Man, it's so weird playing like one of these these bullet hex <laughs> and uh, and be constantly trying to avoid the power ups too. Like I've definitely played those games where it's like, oh, I don't want that one, but they're just all over the place. The power ups are just just everywhere. They're just <laughs> they're just everywhere. Oh, uh, no. The, de the deadly iguana. Oh, well, we're going back this way. All right. <laughs> cool. Never mind. Bye, iguana. I guess the game is like, no. No, iguana's too scary. Let's go down here instead. Did I just kill a flower? <laughs> God. God, so many bugs. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, dang. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. <laughs> no, stop. Stop. Go away. No. Go away. Go away from me. Please. <laughs> They're just coming all over the place. Uh, 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 frog, frog. Okay. Up. Oh. Aha. Ah, we did it. <laughs> Cool. Hooray. Let me take a nice sip of this this uh, green tea before we continue on with new infection. Mmm. <laughs> mmm, delicious. Okay. Okay, time. Time for new infection. Here we go. <laughs> Here we go. New infection. Oh, oh boy. Oh, this is a new one. Cool. <laughs> Shooting these little, these little uh, bouncy balls. Ernesto, thank you for the 50 ARS. I accidentally opened two tabs of the stream. And your echoed voice was ominous in a really cool way. Cool. <laughs> that's uh, that sounds. Uh, that's uh, that sounds great. What if I? What if I'm like? Why don't you do it now? Open up. 
open up the two tabs. And let's see if I can say something cool. That sounds even better with echoes. Sorry, it ruined it, my death ruined the echo. According to chat, it works real well, so that's good. Oh my god, those death bubbles. Those death bubbles so hard. I think the strategy for this level is just gonna be going as dang fast as I can to get the heck out of here. I don't want that. No, I don't want That's the worst one. This is okay. This music is so weird for this level. This isn't really like cave music. Then again, I'm not a music composer for video games, so... Oh, dead. Iguana dead. Sorry. <laughs> Alright, go as fast as we dang can. Oh, hey, look at this. Can I get up here? No, I don't have enough bird power. Oh, dead. <laughs> I wish I did have enough bird power to get through that. I wonder what kind of bird- I wonder what I need to do to get through. I wonder what it is, because I didn't figure out last time, it just worked. I was just there at some point. I had- maybe it was that- those weird power things I absorbed? That was probably it, right? Oh, dead. <laughs> If there's is there game genie for the 32x? <laughs> did, they, did they make a whole game genie just for the 32x? That's what I want to know. They probably didn't. I mean, there's only like there's only like two 32x games, so. <laughs> They only made two games for the 32X. They made this one, and then another one called Sonic Sits at a Desk. That one was pretty good, too. I'm disappointed in Jason's lack of herpetology. I mean, I could be calling everything a bird. That could, <laughs> I could be doing that. Oh, oh, dead again. Dang. <laughs> yeah, I think this is the last level we're gonna get through, because we're, we're just about at an hour. And this is pretty... <laughs> pretty hard. Also, the fact that all this dang stuff just respawns immediately when you're off screen. You know what's super weird about all this? It's honestly very weird that this stuff respawns when you're off screen on some of the levels, but not actually on all the levels. So a lot of the levels it doesn't do that. 
<laughs> Along the levels, that just doesn't happen. But some of them, it does happen. Oh, I guess we can just go... Oh, no. I oh, know. <laughs> I guess we can just go pretty far down, huh? Wait a minute. What does that do? <laughs> I really wish I knew what some of these things do. I thought that that hurt me at first, but I can't tell now. I'm a different color. I'm a different color at this point. I don't know what that means. I've changed colors. <laughs> I'm a slightly different hue. I can't tell if that's a power-up or if it's something that harms me. I just don't understand <laughs> a lot of stuff in this game. I'm a different hue again. <laughs> Here I am. Oh my god. Uh, there's so much goo here. Oh, no, I'm dead. Alright. Oh god, dead. <laughs> okay, so I changed hue with different weapons, I guess. Cool. gonna go down. Avoid the frog, avoid the the giant tongue bird. Get that. Alright, there is some sort of magic down here that I can absorb. Yep. Yep. Alright. Where's the magic? Is the magic down here? Is this the magic? No, this is not the magic. Alright, where's the magic? Oh god, <laughs> that was not the magic. Aha, uh -huh, here- oh. Oh, it killed me though. Alright. the loop. Get the, the loop-de-loop -loop that allows me to take one hit, I believe. I believe that's what that does. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. Oh, yep. I just got my one hit. Dang. Well, here's another loop, so that's good. Alright, go up. Don't get eaten by the frog. We're going the wrong way. We didn't go down the right way. Alright. Okay. <laughs> the frog. Frog got us again. Cool. <laughs> Alright, I, I believe in us this time. I think this is it. Oh, okay, there's that. There's the iguana. Cool. Cool, we don't want to hit the iguana. We don't want to hit that. We don't want to hit any of this junk. Alright, I don't know what that did, but I got something. Or maybe I got hit. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Something happened. But I'm still playing. Alright, the magic goo is around here somewhere. Oh, dang. 
I'm pretty sure that's the magic I need to get. I'm pretty sure I gotta get that magic. Those glowing things. Because I got those last time, and then I was able to open the gate. I don't know if I was able to open the gate because of that. But I have nothing else to go on, <laughs> so... Uh, uh, uh. Oh no! No, 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 no! <laughs> Rolled me up. Rolled me up. Gosh darn. Up, uh, up. Uh. Get up, up. Uh, dead. Shot down. <laughs> Shot down and killed. Oh god, shut down again. <laughs> Anything over here? No. Alright. Yep. Nice try, Paisano. Oh god. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna give it just a little bit more shots. We're at an hour, so it's pretty much the end of the stream, but I just really want to know if it is in fact that magical goo. Oh, nope, nope. Aha! <laughs> I've escaped! I, you can't get me. I'm too quick. That was, that was the bird's last words. Very ironic. <laughs> I just realized just how big that that tongue bird is in compared to my tiny hummingbird. Oh god. <laughs> I have to get I have to get 32x game genie make my bird invincible get a good invincible bird <laughs> I have this uh, this move that I can do which is which makes me go all, all fast and honestly it's not a help <laughs> it's like the bird goes so out of control when I use it it's like I cannot imagine using it and not ending up dying Like, every time I use it, I just get to throw myself into more bugs. I'm not even sure that it would be, like, super helpful for someone who's really good at bullet heck games. Alright, get the magic, get the magic. Oh, dead. <laughs> the, the goo is too big there. I really need one of those uh, hoops at that point. If I got a hoop at that point, then I can just kind of fly in willy-nilly. And I can get hit by the goo and not, not lose. <laughs> Alright, Adam, uh, you... I'm I'm hiding you on the whole channel. You got timed out for spamming and you came back and spammed more, so you're you're gone. Sorry, buddy. <laughs> Sorry. The whole the whole channel you're gone from. Alright, got the got the loop. Oh, lost the loop, got got the loop. Oh, frog. Don't don't wanna touch the frog. Oh god. So so many bugs all at once. Oh god. No. No, no. 
Oh no, I used up my loop. Oh no, my loop. Okay, I got another loop. It's very important to have this loop. Oh, I lost the loop. There's another loop. I got the loop. <laughs> okay, it's very important that I do not lose this loop because I need it to get the goo. I really wish I had a different weapon right now because this weapon's terrible. This weapon's really bad. Oh, I lost my loop. All right, I got the power. Oh God, I just need to make it all the way back. <laughs> I got, I got the power. Yes, time is now my friend, I think. Oh, uh, no, I can't go there. All right. Oop, oop. Oh, no. <laughs> All right, I got this weapon. Is this good? No, I don't think so. Hopefully I have enough energy to break the barrier. Uh, bugs. Uh, bugs. Yes! Uh -huh. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, we did it. Congratulations. <laughs> Congratulations, everyone. Alright, well, I'm taking a screenshot of this. We did, we did so good there. We did so good. C congratulations, bird team. <laughs> that's it, that's it for, uh, for, for tonight. Thank you all for tuning in. The very first 32X game streamed on the Video Game Valley. <laughs> I think that was a good one to start with. I, I like this game. I'm not very good at it, but I appreciate, I appreciate the game. There was a lot of choices they could have made that would have been bad, but they made a lot of good choices. It's just hard. It's just, <laughs> it's just very hard. Very hard. Uh, we'll definitely stream some more 32X and also some Sega CD games in the, in the coming, the coming weeks. Uh, tomorrow we're playing, uh, we're continuing Super Mario Galaxy on the, uh, Wii, and then Tuesday is the Dog Island on the PS2. The rest of the schedule you can check in the description. If you got any questions, I'll answer a few questions before I go. You should play a Fallout game. I do have, I do have a really bad Fallout game on the original Xbox. I'm gonna play that at some point. Um, I would like to play, like, you know, more modern, uh, Fallout stuff on the stream at some point, uh, specifically New Vegas, because I really like that, uh, I'm not gonna do that until I'm doing more, more stream stuff, so probably after the Charlie finale's done, because th those games are, are pretty long. Morrowind again would be great. Yeah, I gotta figure out Morrowind though. <laughs> like the first, the first Elder Scrolls game that I ever played was Oblivion, so I didn't realize what a what a learning curve there was gonna be going to Morrowind. So I need to, I need to. I need to learn up on Morrowind before I start playing again, because it was basically just me running around trying to figure out what to do, and it was kind of uh, too stressful. <laughs> Help, I've been robbed and my hamster's gone. I can only conclude aliens. Definitely aliens. Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely aliens. You know, if you want, if you want... If you send me for a small fee, I can investigate this matter. <laughs> this matter, a very small, reasonable fee. Uh, I charge, I charge one hundred twenty-five dollars an hour, and I can investigate this this robbery by aliens. I'm I'm looking out for you, Aaron. Help. 
Have you played the NES Silver Surfer? Uh, no, I don't think I have. I don't even know if I have that one. There's a bunch of games that I've gotten in the past, like, since I've been streaming, and I have a hard time these days remembering what games I played when I was younger at a friend's house or I saw at the store, looked up, and then decided not to get versus ones that I actually have. <laughs> so, without looking it up, I have no idea if I actually have that one. Have you ever played Destroy All Humans? I do have that one. I do know that I have that one. So, most of the games that I have, I will, I will try streaming at some point. If there's a game in my list that I have, I'll probably attempt to stream it at some point. With some exceptions. There's some games I'm not going to stream, honestly. <laughs> Some, there's definitely some some games that are not appropriate for the valley. Are all your games organized nicely, or is it total chaos? Uh, I have, you yeah, know, they're, they're organized. I got uh, like separate sections for each each console. They're. Uh, I plan on doing more thorough thorough arrangements at some point but right now they're all like they, they, they look very nice which is important <laughs> my Sega Saturn games are the most organized like I have them essentially organized by genre I've been thinking about especially because I, I stream now I've been thinking about organizing them in alphabetical order uh just so if I do, like, when I do audience choice days, it's easier for me to find stuff. But alphabetical works not as good for my brain. Like, organizing by genre is a lot easier for my, my mind <laughs> to, to figure out when I'm looking at a shelf of games. Have you ever played Destiny 2? No, I haven't played the first Destiny either. It takes a lot for, like, a first-person shooter to really sink its teeth into me. Do you have a Virtual Boy? Uh, I have, I have five Virtual, <laughs> five Virtual Boys. I got five of them. I also have every game that was released on the Virtual Boy in the U.S. I'm a big, big Virtual, <laughs> big Virtual Boy fan. I don't have those listed on my, uh, my games list, because I specifically only have the systems that I can stream listed there. Destroy All Humans is good, but whether or not it's valley appropriate is debatable. Yeah, I haven't. Uh, it's, I, I don't even remember if I've played that one. If I did, it was a long time ago. I do, bef when I pick a game that's questionable, I do look up video on it before I, <laughs> before I play it. To try to see if it's, like, obviously not appropriate. Why don't you play Atari for a stream? Uh, I have done Atari game streams. Um, I will be doing some more at some point. I would love to see you playing Mafia since it's kind of hilariously bug-ridden, even though it's a first-person shooter. Yeah, I have not. I have not played Mafia. I'm pretty sure I have Mafia. I might have Mafia. I'm not. <laughs> I'm not sure. There's, there's a couple of first-person shooters, or shooters in general that I am gonna play on stream at some point, but it's a very particular list. It's <laughs> a very, very particular list. What do you consider inappropriate? Uh, I wouldn't... I'm not going to stream... Okay, so here's... Here's the, here's the games that I would consider inappropriate. I don't want to play a game with... Uh, upsetting violence. So... So, like, I've played, like, House of the Dead. Which is... Like, there's a lot of violence in that game. But it's of a type that I feel like is not going to bother that many people. Um, 
I also wouldn't play a game that has, like, that has nudity. And I'm also not going to stream, like, a game that has, uh... This 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 one's harder to re <laughs> harder to figure out beforehand, but like I don't want to play games that have have like people saying terrible things. Basically, uh, I have I have de accidentally stumbled into some of those <laughs> into some of those, uh, you know. So games games with like racial slurs and like heavy heavy sexism and stuff. It's hard, it's hard to figure out what games are going to have what. Like, I, I was playing a, uh, what was it? This was in the early days of the stream. Uh, I was playing Gilligan's Island on the NES, and that game ended up <laughs> having some stuff I didn't want to stream, where it was like, Oh no! It was it was it suddenly got super racist about the island natives, and you had to go and kill all these <laughs> these natives. And I was like, oh no! I don't want to don't want to stream this. <laughs> so yeah, just this that kind of stuff. Gilligan's Island. Yeah, yeah. That was <laughs> There are some games where it's very obvious that it's not going to be stream appropriate, and then other games like Gilligan's Island, in which, honestly, I have... <laughs> it's like I had no clue beforehand. I didn't even think to look into that game too deeply, because it's, it's an NES game. Thank you again for naming my cat, Jason. It's the first orange kitten we've had. That seems healthy and lived, so I'm extremely happy. Cool. My my first cat was an orange cat. Uh, I na uh, I named him Spike, and I loved Spike. Spike was a great cat. Spike was a very smart cat. Watch out! Watch out for. Watch out for your cat, orange cats. They can be very very smart, just like all cats. <laughs> Garfield on Genesis, perhaps? I do have a couple Garfield games. I am 100% going to be streaming Garfield games. I want to know if Destiny 2 is too violent. I just started playing it. I don't know if it's too violent to stream. I don't think something like Destiny 2 would be too violent. It's... It's just... Kind of, I think, probably too dull <laughs> to, to, to for this particular stream. Like, it's not the right kind of dull. It's not, like, birds flying around in a cave shooting is the right kind of dull. Destiny 2 is kind of dull. Probably not. I don't know. Play Fallout instead of Destiny. Yeah, Fallout's, like, the right kind of Cause you know that that game's that game's pretty wacky. It's got a it's got a bunch of wacky stuff going on with it. You know, you get to go to dinosaur land. You get to fight some big spiders. There's a bunch of <laughs> bunch of bunch of weird stuff going on in between the shooting. Would you ever stream the old original Doom? Well, I have uh, on order, which is coming in at some point. The original Doom for the 32X, so so I will have a streamable copy of original Doom. Play that N64 South Park game. I do have it. I do have that N64 South Park game. Not high up on my list of games to stream, but it's. It's a game I have, certainly. Check's Quest was better. Check's Quest? What is Ch what is what is Check's Quest? 
I'm looking up Chex's quest. Chex's quest. A non-violent first-person shooter created in 1996 by Digital Cafe as a Chex serial promotion. It's a total conversion of the more violent video game Doom. <laughs> oh, cool. Well, that sounds, that sounds pretty good. <laughs> Jack's Quest. It's too bad it was only on DOS and Windows. I don't... I could probably figure out a way to stream that. I do have, uh... I do plan on doing PC stuff at some point. Probably play it through DOS Box. What game will be closer to finishing of the ones I'm playing right now? I'm not sure. I'm not sure how much... I thought I was pretty far into the Dog Island, but... Uh... I'm not. I'm not. I looked up... I, I was looking it up. I was like, I wonder if I'm near the end of the Dog Island, and I'm definitely not. Absolutely not. So... What else am I playing? Wednesdays, I'm playing Harry Potter. I think I'm pretty close to beating that Harry Potter game, right? I gotta be, huh? I gotta be pretty close. And then, uh, Eternal Darkness. I can't imagine I'm close to being that. I'm probably not. So I have no idea. I think I'm, pr I think I'm pretty much, like, halfway through most of the games I'm playing right now. What is your preferred starter Pokemon? I mean, my favorite is always going to be Bulbasaur. Because that was my first Pokemon ever, you know? It was just me and Bulbasaur versus the world. Going around dogfighting together. <laughs> Would you play a heavy story-driven visual novel night like 999? Uh, I, I mean, I'm definitely going to play some visual novels. I don't know if I'm going to play 999, but... <laughs> I have played 999. I don't know if I'm going to play that on stream. Uh, but I'm definitely going to play some visual novel stuff uh, when, I, when I start streaming PC things. What about Ratchet and Clank? I'm not like a huge fan of the Ratchet and Clank series. I, uh, yeah. I'm not like a huge, a huge <laughs> fan of the Ratchet and Clank games. I don't know, they just never clicked with me. Unsubscribed? Uh, I got some Ratchet and Clank fans here. <laughs> it's like Ratchet and Clank. Ratchet and Clank is, I mean, it's fine. I don't know. I've tried playing a couple of Ratchet and Clank games, and I just, you know. Are you a boy or a girl? Very, very good question. Uh, probably, probably neither of those. Probably, <laughs> de definitely neither of those. Jackson Daxter. I like Jackson Daxter more. I, I haven't played a lot of a lot of Jackson Daxter games. I played Daxter on the PSP, and I really liked that game. I've played a couple of other Jackson Daxter games. I haven't beaten them, though. It's fine. <laughs> I, I, do, I do enjoy Jackson Daxter. I think the thing that with the Ratchet and Clank, ga Clank games is, like, the, the humor of it never really got me. It always felt... It always just turned me off. I don't know.
What weird console would you like to have but you can't buy right now? Um, I mean, I've always, I've always kind of wanted to have a Atari Jaguar. Just because when I was a kid, I really wanted to have a Jaguar. But then as an, when I got a little older, I was like, oh, there's all the games on the Jaguar are terrible. And that's kind of why I never got into Jaguar. Because there's only like a couple of games that I would even want to play on it. Like, even with a Sega 32X attachment, like, I put off getting the 32X for a long time uh, because there's just not a whole lot of games on it. But there are some really good ones, like the game we played tonight, like the, like the bird game. But with the Jaguar, it's like, what, what do you got? You got that one Alien vs. Predator game. You've got Tempest 2000. And it's, that's about it <laughs> for the good ones. That's about it. That's that's pretty much it. I would still like to have it at some point, but I mean they're expensive, so uh, the actual answer for like assist for I, I've come up with a much better answer, and that's the Vectrex. Like I actually do genuinely want the Vectrex, and the Vectrex has genuinely good games on it. So, Vectrex. That's my answer. I can't stream that, though. So, it's probably going to be an extremely long time, if if ever, that I get a Vectrex. It's hard to buy those online, too, because they have, they have a, lot of, uh, a lot of problems that are hard to determine without seeing it in person. What's a Vectrex? It was this uh, all-in-one system. It, it's, it has, a, like, a vector display... So instead of showing, like, uh, like you know, a, a regular CRT display shows uh, dots. They're not, they're not technically pixels, but, you know, it's, it's still it's an array of dots that you're getting. Whereas the Vectrex, it's vector-based, so it's, it's, the beam is shooting lines, so it's perfectly smooth. <laughs> perfectly smooth graphics. It's got some, some cool games you can play on it. You can play some, some Asteroids. Play some, play some, some good, some good games on the Vectrex. <laughs> There's a couple of other systems that kind of fall in the same camp as the, uh, the Atari Jaguar. It's like the, uh, the, the Philips CDI and the Atari 5400, I think that's <laughs> what it was. Just a bunch of these consoles that came out, didn't really have good games on it, and then disappeared. Systems that are expensive to get now, but, but, uh don't have enough games to really justify the the extremely high price. Jason, I noticed that Robert has started streaming immediately after your stream. Does that mean he is secretly watching? I don't know. Robert, Robert, are you are you there, Robert? My my beautiful Robert, Atari seventy eight hundred. Oh, I've got a seventy eight hundred. The seventy eight hundred is good and has good games on it. Like that's 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 one of those systems that's that's actually good. Like the system itself, good. Also the games, good. Seventy eight hundred, a good system. It also plays uh uh, uh twenty six hundred games, which is very good. Three DO, yeah, like the th there's the three DO, there's the um, what do you call it? Dag, I can't remember. There's another system. Bunch of the, there's there's some systems out there that are have some good games on it. 
but are also too expensive. <laughs> I think I've got like the array of systems I've got now. I'm 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 happy with. I'm happy with this array. I got I got lots of games from pretty much every generation, except for the first. I don't have I don't have an Odyssey or or anything like that. I can't I can't play any Pong. I picture you as Robert. I can't differentiate either of you. I mean, we look... We look a little similar. Robert's better looking than I am. <laughs> Robert's got... Robert's got, like... Robert's got one of those, like... Robert's got a scoundrel face. You know, you look at him and you're like, that, that guy's up to no good, you know? He's got that mischievous scoundrel face. But, like... The attractive scoundrel face. He's <laughs> got, he's got one of those like faces where you know he's a he's up to no good, but you kind of want in on it. I've just got, I've just got like a nerd face. <laughs> I've got, like I've got, I've got a good, I've got a good nerd face. Like I'm, I'm happy with my face. I think I've got a decent, a decent face. I've got a good chin, you know, but it's still definitely unmistakably a nerd face. Robert could, like, show up on a motorcycle and you wouldn't think, why, what, where, where'd you, where'd you get a motorcycle? Whose motorcycle is that? You'd be just like, uh, oh, yeah, that's, that's one of the, that, that's one of the, the, the snakes. <laughs> I was trying to think of a gang name. The only one thing I could think of was snakes. That's one of the snakes right there. The Hollywood snakes. How's Shadowstone Park going? I need to see more. Uh, Shadowstone Park was... Uh, Frederator picked that up for VRV. Uh, they own the rights to it. If they want more episodes, uh, they have to order them. I can't. I can't make more episodes on my own. <laughs> it's entirely up to them. I have no idea if they're going to order more. I don't think they are, on account of they haven't said anything about it, and it's been a while. Tunnel snakes. <laughs> yeah, tunnel snakes. Tunnel snakes rule. Do you have a Greek nose, Jason? Yeah, I got a pretty Greek nose. It's not the Greekest nose in my family. My cousin Chris has a has a reasonably Greek nose. My mom has a Greeker nose than I do. But I definitely have a Greek nose. Well, that's it for today. Thank you all for tuning in. I will be back tomorrow playing Super Mario Galaxy on the Wii. And every every day I stream. I stream every night. Every night. Tune in. Hey, come, come on over. Come on over to the valley. Tune in. Until tomorrow, I hope you have a great day. Once tomorrow comes, it's... <laughs> all bets are off. Have a good, a good evening, a good night, a good morning. Farewell, everyone. I love you all.